up Shane Squad, how are you today? Hope you are having an awesome, amazing day. As you've seen, I haven't got to really upload vlogs because I lost my flash drive, so if you guys have not seen the two update videos that I was posting, that is the whole reason why I haven't been uploading a vlog, because I lost my flash drive. And that little flash drive is what I have to use to basically transfer my files. Like, I put my memory card in the computer, and then I stick the flash drive in the computer. Everything that I have on my memory card, I transfer it over to the flash drive. Well, the flash drive is a flash drive that sticks into your phone. And all them files, I can transfer to my phone. That's how I edit my videos. Because I don't really have a laptop or a really good editing software. So I edit from iMovie. The other day, we went to Jen's mom's and I went to go into the big field and I sat down because I had my flash drive in my pocket. And I guess it somehow fell out of my pocket. And I went back everywhere to look for it, and I could not find it at all. I have no idea where it is, how it fell out of my pocket, because I checked my pocket and there's no holes in it. I don't even know how my flash drive, like, disappeared, but it did. Anyways, it had my vlog, my whole vlog that was supposed to go up that day. It had all my photography pictures that I never uploaded before. The most recent abandoned house I went to, all of them pictures are gone. Like, I lost it. Like, it, it's completely gone. I actually end up realizing a fan actually sent me a flash drive, which Jacob, Jacob, thank you so much for sending that flash drive because I totally forgot he sent that to me. I forgot that he sent that to me until he made a comment on my video stating that he sent that flash drive. And I was like, oh, wait, I do have that. So I went to go try it out, and it took me all day trying to figure out what app I had to use to be able to use the flash drive. Well, once I figured out what the app was, finally got it all figured out. So I can actually use this flash drive to transfer my stuff. And I found out it is 128 gig. That is a lot of memory that I could possibly store onto that flash drive. But hopefully I don't end up losing this one, but so crazy that he ended up sending me that flash drive maybe like a month ago. And I still had my flash drive, so I had no idea that I was going to end up losing my flash drive. And that's why I say everything happens for a reason. There was a reason why he sent me that flash drive. There's always a reason for everything. You might not know the reason right now, but in the future, you're going to look back and be like, oh crap. If that would have never happened, this would have never happened, you know? It's just something like that. If he would have never sent that flash drive, I would be stuck without a flash drive until I got the money to go buy one because they're pretty expensive. And I don't really have the money right now because I had to pay rent, I had to work on bills and everything because where we just recently moved. So I don't really have the money to just go out and buy a whole new flash drive. 30 to $35 just for a little tiny flash drive. That's just crazy how everything worked out. But I really appreciate it, Jacob. I'm gonna put his YouTube link down below if you guys wanna go check out his YouTube channel, go subscribe, show him some love. Just thank Jacob. Because if it wasn't for him sending that flash drive, we wouldn't even be able to be making vlogs. Even though I missed two days because I had no idea. One, I forgot I got that flash drive. And two, it took me most of the day to try to figure out how to work the flash drive because he said he never used the flash drive. Because I reached out to him and I asked him, do you know what app I'm supposed to use for this flash drive? And he said he had no idea because he never used it. So this is like a brand new flash drive that's never been used. I even searched it on Google. Still couldn't find anything on Google of what app I was supposed to use. The way I found out what app I was supposed to use was I searched the flash drive on Amazon. And Amazon has all the description about the flash drive. And on the description, it told me. And I'm like, that's crazy that an Amazon description explains what app I'm supposed to use. But when you Google it, it doesn't even tell you anything. It makes no sense. If you have not seen yesterday's video that I posted, I mentioned that Gabrielle and Jen actually got a job. They went to their interview yesterday. Today, they had to go back to go fill out some papers, and that's where they're at right now. It is like 9 o'clock in the morning, so I am up bright and early. Well, not like really early, but, you know, it's usually earlier than I usually wake up. Usually, I wake up around 10 or 11, but they got a job. So, when they go out, to go to work, I can catch a ride with them and wherever they're at, I can just walk around those areas, work my way back up this way, have some new places to explore, find new places to go to. I have so many ideas. Now I can actually film 
and do what I want to do. So I just remembered that abandoned barge I went to that had a little park by the river over here in Huntington. I actually live so close to that. And that's crazy that I went to that place and walked around this area and not even knowing I could possibly be living in this area. And what's even insane is that I even said in my video that I wish we lived around this area or at least lived in Huntington so that way I would have so much more stuff to do. Look at us now. We're living in Huntington. Be careful what you wish for. Because sometimes wishes do come true. So don't wish something if you don't really want it to happen. I mean, obviously I wanted to be living in Huntington. I'm saying like in general. Some people will say, oh, I wish you would go die or something. And then they not mean it. Always be careful what you wish for. Because things will actually come true. I'm just trying to think of where. So I'm thinking I should probably go down this way. Because the river would be over that way. But there's like a construction place or something over here. So I'm going to go all the way down here and then work my way over. So the park would have to be somewhere around this area. Since I actually have to go right by the house, I'm going to actually go inside and grab the pocket knife. I was, was going to carry it around with me, but I totally forgot about it. So that way I can have at least a little bit of protection on me. I'm not saying that like Huntington is bad or everybody that's in Huntington is bad. It's just in general, just to be safe because I am carrying around a really expensive camera. There is some crazy people out here. I at least want to have some little bit of protection. Someone even mentioned I should get pepper spray, but I don't even know where you would get pepper spray at. But right now I'm just gonna carry a pocket knife. Huh. This is what the knife looks like. That's what it looks like, it's pretty cool. At least I think it's pretty dope. Don't mess with me, you will make me. Oh, I see, they put cones around that big hole. Oh wow, this is the board that was over top of it. That's how big it was. That's crazy. And then they put these around it. That's so crazy. It, I just showed you guys that the other day and it had those boards over top of it. And it looks like the boards was there for a really long time. And then after I go and record it, as you see, there's cones around it. I swear that there's like somebody that watches my videos and goes back and tries to like fix everything or goes and sees everything that I do or something. If you go from the beginning of my videos when I first started vlogging and literally watch every single video, you would see that this has been happening ever since I started vlogging. It's like the government or the state is like watching every single thing I do and they see like all these little mistakes that I see and they'll go back and fix it or try to fix it. I'm like a spy to them or something. I'm like their walking camera with everything. <laughs> this way would be the river more likely. So maybe if I go down this way. If this is the right road, I literally live down the road from this park. Oh, this looks like a really cool building. It looks like it would be abandoned, but it's not. I can hear air conditioners on. I wonder what this is. It looks really cool to be able to explore. To go up inside of it just to see what it looks like. And then go to the very top. Yeah, this is... This is where the park is. So I literally live right beside, well not literally beside, but literally an alleyway away from this park down here. Who would ever thought that after exploring down here that I would be living down this way? That's crazy. Because I didn't even know where my grandma bought the houses at. So I had no idea where they were. Share the road. Meow. Hi kitty. Hi. Hi, you're pretty. Yeah, you're pretty. Meow. He's just like looking at me like, don't talk to me. Are you a grumpy kitty? Huh? Are you a grumpy kitty? Oh, look at this car right here. This is nice. I like this. One day I will have a car that looks like that. Don't know when. Who knows when? Might not be right now, but one day. Literally, right here. There's a squirrel. Squirrel! Look, we can come over here and play tennis. Always wanted to play tennis. And basketball. That'd be pretty cool if somebody left a basketball over here. I don't see none. Basketball is one of my favorite sports, so I would definitely just make a whole, not like a whole vlog, make a vlog of coming down here and playing basketball together. And what's crazy is that 
when I came down here, there was a lot of writing on the tables. And now there's none. And they must have painted over it. Except right here, there's something right here. Dang, nobody left a basketball. Oh, look at the river. Oh, it looks so pretty. It's so relaxing, nice looking at the river. I didn't get to look at this because there was actually kids here the last time. That's like a big slide too. But I still can't go down it right now. As you guys know, I was dealing a... Crap, what's it called? The hemorrhoid. And it actually has got better. Like, it's still there. But it's not as big as it was. I can actually walk. And I can actually move around a lot and I still have a little bit of trouble getting up and if I sit down really hard it hurts it has got a lot better but I still can't like go and play on playgrounds yet or anything I give it like two more days I should be able to and maybe I can come back over here or go to the other park and go down the slides and actually do what I wanted to do but that's crazy that I literally live close to this park now and I can come over and play basketball I can come over and play tennis I can literally go back down to the banded barge over there. That's when the water is not up. I might end up running back to the house and grab me something cold to drink and then maybe take another walk. Maybe go down some more roads that I haven't quite yet went down just to see what's all around me. If there's any banded houses or anything. So far I haven't really seen any, but there is one abandoned place. Well, I knew about this place a long time ago. Friend Jamie was telling me about it. I was always trying to get him to take me to it. But he, he never would. So the other day, someone messaged me on Facebook and told me about this place. I'm not going to say where it is because every time I say I'm going to go explore somewhere, someone always ends up going there. It just seems like that every time I go somewhere or say something, that someone always ends up going there before I do. I'm just not going to say where it is. I'll tell you it is abandoned and it's huge. Also, I haven't showed you guys in the basement lately. Look at this, guys. This is the basement. Look, I got my punching thing now. All I have to do is just fill up the bottom with water and then blow up the top part, and I could be able to start doing my exercises and working out. But look, everything, it's dry. No leaks or anything. And what's crazy is that the other day we had a really hard rain came down here and there's no leaks at all. Fixing the gutters and taking the gutters out from them going down into the sewage actually helps so much. When it rained, all them gutters that was connected to the pipe that goes to the sewage, which is this pipe right here, all that water was filling up into the sewage tank and it would just overflow. So it would just push itself out. So sewage and water, everything would just push itself out because it was so full. It didn't have enough time to sit there and drain like it's supposed to. We went and fixed the, fixed all the gutters and this is what it looks like. Remember, all this was filled with water. It was about that much water and I was scooping it up by a cup and a bucket. That's what caused me to have this freaking hemorrhoid because I was constantly bending over and picking up heavy buckets of water for two days in a row. It just put so much strain on me and pulled all those muscles that it just caused me to have a hemorrhoid. But it's insane of how good it looks. Like, it looks amazing. Now I think the only thing I have to do is like go sweep it, pick up all the dirt, but I scrubbed these floors. I know there's like still a couple dirt, but I scrubbed it the best I could and it looks so much better than when we first moved in. So I'm actually pretty hungry right now, so I'm not making something to eat. Ooh. Egg rolls. I love egg rolls but they have to be the chicken i don't like the pork there's pork egg rolls and there's chicken egg rolls so if you have not tried chicken egg rolls all it has in it is um cabbage chicken carrots and celery that's all it has and it's so good but the thing is i like to get them a little crunchy like the writing part crunchy and then get sweet and sour sauce the best sweet and sour sauce is this one. You get it from Walmart, and it's actually in the, the Chinese food and Japanese food are. Sweet and sour sauce. It will look like just like this. This sweet and sour sauce is amazing. 
I, I like this so much better than regular sweet and sour sauce. But I'm going to make me some egg rolls. Oh, and I actually have one left. I've been eating these all week. Like, they're so delicious. And it comes with its own sweet and sour sauce, but I don't really care for their sweet and sour sauce, but if you guys wanted to try it, if you ever got these, then you could try it. I really prefer the other sweet and sour sauce. Just gotta plug it up. The reason why I had to plug it up is because we are doing this thing that, well, somebody didn't unplug this one. We try to unplug everything. If we're not using it, we unplug it. Even if it's off and nobody's using it, even if it's plugged in, it's still taking energy. We're trying to save as much energy that we can so that way our electric bill doesn't get so high. Like you're charging cords, if you're not using it, unplug it from the wall. Anything you're not using, like the microwave, the coffee pot, stuff like that, if you're not gonna use it, unplug it. The refrigerator and stove, and so obviously that would have to stay plugged in. Once I'm done with this, I would actually unplug this. What's crazy is perfect timing. And Jen just called me to tell me that she's on her way home because I told her that if I'm out when she comes home because where she was planning on wanting to go to her mom's to do some laundry, that to call me. I just walked in the door and she just called me to tell me that she's on her way home. And I also made a new Snapchat because I ended up deleting my other Snapchat. So if you guys want to add me, I'm going to be posting like pictures, my links to my YouTube videos. If you guys want to add me on Snapchat, it is ShaneVlogs55. Go follow me. I see you up there. I see the tutu. I see the tutu. What are you doing up there? Huh? What are you doing? Oh, look at that stretch. Look at that stretch. Yeah, the tutu. -tu -tu. Are you a tutu? Huh? What are you doing, tutu? Why? I like your silent meows. I like how he goes, and nothing comes out. He, <laughs> he's silent meows. I do 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 do. Yeah, do 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 do. Why? You such a pretty boy. You such a good boy. Yeah, you such a good boy. Do do do. Why? Yeah, you such a good boy. Why? The thing is, I'm not going to share my Snapchat to anything. Like, I'll obviously put my link, like, on my Facebook of where it shows the links and on my Instagram where it has my Twitter, Instagram, all of that. But I'm not going to tell anybody that I have a Snapchat. If you're a real fan and everything, you'll end up adding me if you have Snapchat. I know a lot of people don't have Snapchat. That's why I'm putting it in the vlog, so that way I I'm not going to go add people. I'm just going to let people add me. And what? You always look like you're grumpy. He has, like, this grumpy face. But he's so sweet. Yeah, you're so sweet. Oh, there's Cleo. Cleo. What are you doing, Cleo? She always looks grouchy, too. Yeah, you always look grouchy. Yeah, you look grouchy, too. You look grouchy, too. <laughs> Cleo. Oh, my Cleo. Are you stuck? Do likes kisses? Do you like kisses? Huh? Cleo, do you want kisses? Do you want kisses, Cleo? Come on. <laughs> Ow! She's trying to get the string off my shorts. No, two's getting my necklace. <laughs> no. Cleo. Hi, Cleo. What are you doing, Cleo? This is Gabrielle's shirt. And no, it's not! What? <laughs> Why? <laughs> Put it on. <laughs> Why did you get that? Why did Gabrielle get a regular shirt and you got that? Oh, actually. Are you a manager or something? It's kind of cute. It looks like something a manager would wear. No. No, they just didn't have her size. Oh. This, I, have, I got a little bit bigger, obviously. Will I you get one eventually, pants. or? Yeah. <laughs> I, big, I actually didn't get I one. I got big boobs. Should I wear that? But I least, can't wear a large. It looks kind of cute with the jeans, though. Yeah, I was it planning on wearing yeah, this outfit. Yeah, it doesn't. It doesn't look bad with the jeans, actually. It looks kind of cute.
You don't get no cool Speedway t-shirt like me. <laughs> <laughs> I like that fresh coffee. You don't like my blue ugly smock? It looks good on you. No, I no, no. Smoke. Listen, you know what's funny? You know what's funny is that you were gonna actually wear something like that this morning. Yeah, I was gonna exactly. wear it. Exactly. <laughs> you were gonna wear this. Yeah, you were gonna wear that this I morning. I was gonna wear this. And How weird. You know, you're a lot of questions that people's gonna think you're a manager. Yeah, I'm not. I, but like, no, I'm. I'm it just... still looks good on you because blue looks good on you. Okay. But no, I'm just, you don't have my shirt size because I can't wear an extra large. I have yeah. chest. And an extra large won't, I can't, I won't be able to tuck my extra large. So I was like, I need a, like a, a 1X at least, just to be safe. You look good in blue. I this think it'd be. This is my smock. <laughs> Jen looking like a manager. It actually looks like a regular shirt. If I didn't know that you, that was a Speedway thing, I would thought you were just wearing it, to, you know, to wear it. I feel like my grandma, my grandma had something like this, except it had long sleeves on it. I swear. It was like a smock, like a cover-up. I always call them cover-ups. But it was blue and it had sleeves because my grandma was always cold. Yeah. And I figured I just got this one. I got the super, but I figured we could just live one because you never okay. drink a full one. Okay. So you can have the first drink if you want. So we are on our way to go do laundry. And also, I forgot to mention that today, Kathy is actually going to go get her other knee surgery. And that's where she's at right now. I'm pretty sure they already made it there by now. She's already in surgery. She oh, was, well. They left at 4 o'clock in the morning, got up God. there about uh, 5.30. She's in Athens. Look, here's Mango. Hi, Mango. <laughs> what is your issue? So Kathy ended up getting the cats a little stand like we got too. It's all fuzzy. What are you all doing? Oreo, look how big Oreo's getting. There's three new kittens. They're all black and white except for one of them is actually tannish white. Here's one of them. Oh, there's, oh you can see their little faces. Aren't those your babies? Huh? Are those your babies? I put some food out so maybe like they would come over. I'm actually gonna go relook outside and see if I can find my flash drive. Like, cause I know when I was looking, I was really upset. So maybe my upset mine, I maybe could have overlooked it or something. But even if I do find it, it's probably not gonna work. It's where it's got rained on and everything. If it fell, it would be laying like on top of the grass. It's just a big flash drive, and like there's no way it could just sink down into the ground. I just can't really remember which way I went when I was going this way. I don't know if I went straight through like this or if I went around like that. I know I had it in my pocket because I remember reaching down and I felt outside my pocket and I felt that my flash drive was still there. So somehow when I went down over here to sit down, it somehow disappeared. Like right through here is where I was sitting. That looks like hair. So see how it fell out of my pocket. And then I came over here and sat down on this chair. I just still don't see how it would have fell. Those crows getting mad about cool. Cool. When I got up from there, I came over here and I went straight to the back porch. And I sat down on the step right here. This is where I sat down at. So Kathy is back from her knee surgery. First one. I was just going to say which one was worse, the first one or the second one? Second. It's because I put more weight on my right. Ow. You want to check it? Nope. Yeah, I did. 
forgot to tell the vlog that I went through the whole field and I could not find my flash drive. Where I was sitting at the chair, I moved the chair and I ended up getting stung because there's a big old nest of yellow jackets. And so now... Yeah, so I'm right about here somewhere. Uh, it's really it's, swollen and hot. Yeah, you tell. Oh, like yeah, I swelled. Like, right here somewhere you got stung. <laughs> But we are going to go grab some food for Bill and Kathy because Kathy is just laying in bed. She's not going to be able to do a, anything for a good couple of days because where she just had knee surgery. Like, just thinking about it makes my knees hurt. So I think it's like a symphony pain or sympathy. Am I saying it right? Sympathy pain. Yes. Sympathy pain. Yeah, you said it right. And if you don't know what that is, it's like you know that someone's hurt. Say, for example, somebody went and broke their arm. You would start getting pain in your arm because you're basically feeling their pain, like you feel bad. It's, that's what I'm getting in my knees. It's just like, ugh. So I imagine what her mom's you know, going I through. I felt bad because I felt bad the first time when she had it because she was hurting so bad. She said it was such a regret. She regretted doing it. You know, the first day of surgery, you're, you hurt. You, you know it hurts. You know yeah. it feels bad. But after she was getting better and doing her physical activities and stuff and doing physical therapy, she was glad that she did it. She'll be like this for a few days. She'll be like, I regret it. It hurts. I don't, I wish I never done it. She'll regret it. Then she won't. That's probably how I'm going to be if I ever have you to get surgery on my knees because I have bad knees as well. But. My face is so, look at this. It also could be because of sweat. Ugh. And look at this new one I got. It's probably mostly because of sweat because I've been getting them right here underneath my chin. For some reason, when I lay down or I sit, I guess where I'm getting chunkier, my fat roll right here underneath my neck, when I look down, it gets so much sweat, so I get so many pimples right here now. So it could be from sweat because you're constantly hot. That's why I can't wait until fall. I just want not cold weather. I don't want okay. super, super cold weather. I just want cool weather where you can wear a sweater and be fine. I don't want the snowy, cold, oh my god, I'm freezing my tits off weather. I just want nice, cool, nice breeze. I just want cool weather. I hate this hot. I'm sweaty. And it's gross. My face hates me. Jen's one of those people that has the countdown of when it's Halloween. Oh, I swear. If Halloween's <laughs> my favorite season anyways, but look at the deers. Aw. Hi. Oh, this one has the antlers. Oh, look at her ant or his antlers. Oh, oh they're running. They're gone. They're, they're like, run. Them. Bye. Just ended the whole clip. Just I forgot we were still talking. I got sidetracked by deers. I was like, did we even finish our sentence? <laughs> but no, I literally am. I literally have a countdown of how long it is to Halloween because it's my favorite season. Hopefully, that means you can actually go trick-or-treating this year if you don't have to work. Even if you do, I can go out trick-or-treating and get tons of candy, and you can come home to candy. Didn't you do that at Food Fair? Yeah. Yeah, you did. Yeah, because uh, you said that you were late on getting dressed. And that you went up here and trick-or-treated a little yeah. bit while I was at work and I got all your candy. You can trick-or-treat for us. <laughs> I don't really eat a lot of candy or chocolate. There's times that I crave like candy, but it's just, it's really rare for me to just sit down and eat candy. So basically all my candy goes to Jen, especially the chocolate. And we didn't even say where we're going or nothing. We just like showed my mom getting home and then we're leaving. Yeah, and I said that we're going to go get Kathy oh, and food. I didn't hear you. Yeah, I said that we're going to get them food because where Kathy can't really get up and oh, do anything. I must not have heard you. I think I was filling my vape. That's what oh, I Oh, probably. I hear it. I hear it. Look at all the sunflowers. They're growing. Oh, they're so pretty. You have some right here, too. Oh, that big old batch right there. Look how cute Mango is right now. Yeah. I have jeans and I have like capris and stuff. I have a couple of leggings, but... I got a question. When the hell did I take you to race? Uh, seven years ago. <laughs> We're coming into Walmart because Jen needs to find her a belt for when she starts this job. Hey, that looks like my bike in the back. But it does look like it. I think it's like the same collar. Did you see this little Volkswagen, the bug? Look how it has like on the side. I've never seen one like that before. Oh, that's cute. Wow, Mart. Oh, it's so hot out here. It's just because I'm out here. Oh. <laughs> You're supposed to say it's because of me. I mean, you are hot you know too. No, I get made fun of my smock, and now I get made fun that I'm not hot. <laughs> oh, I love that shirt. It says, love who you want to love. Aww. Well, that's a cool bag. Here's a 3XL, see what this is. 
Oh, it's blue. Oh, you don't, you can't use blue? Oh, they have black. Yeah. So well, there's got, one like black right there. Yeah, but this one's a 32. Well, don't they have one like it? I'm so Jen found her a belt. Yeah, that one works. How's it look? I like it on you. Yeah? Yeah. I'm saying I fixed my pants. And look, you can like take your keys and like fasten it like the holes yeah. too. So this one it is. I was like, I really like this one. So I was like, can we find one like this? <laughs> I wore a belt since Arby's. And how many years ago was that? Uh, go about three or four years ago. Look at these bags. This is like something I need to have when I'm walking around. Every time I come here, they never have anything like this. There's even like a little... I'm gonna have to remember that they keep them right here where the wallets and stuff are. Oh, look at this wallet, babe. Oh, that is awesome. I actually really like that. Oh yeah, here you go. Here's you a purse. Oh, perfect. <laughs> what if I said I got you a new purse? I put in a big huge box and you're thinking it's a huge purse. <laughs> it's that. <laughs> what would you done? I'd be like, thanks, but what is this? Yours only to fit a quarter I in there. I can't even... <laughs> You're a bit a quarter in there. Is this even? I don't even know what oh, it's for. Oh, it's an for. earbud case. Oh. I really like this one though for you. Thank you for choosing Wendy's. What can I get for you? Hi, I got two coupons for buy one, get one free large Frosties. You, want, you okay. said you want chocolate? Okay, and you said you have yeah. two of those coupons? Yeah, I have two coupons, so we're going to get like four Frosties in total. Three okay, of them are going to be chocolate, and one of them is going to be that new strawberry one. What else can I get for you? Are we good? Yeah. Yep. And that, that's all. Go ahead and post to the first window. Thank you. So there's dragonflies just flying around now. You see the dragonflies? Look at Yeah, I think there's a meaning for seeing them. I'm gonna hold one. They must be attracted to these. I don't think they could feel us being here. Oh my gosh, there's an update on the plants. Holy crap, that's huge. You're gonna have to pick those soon, they're gonna go bad. Yeah, I need to get them. Can you go ahead and pick them all? How, I don't know how you yes. pick. Yeah. No, yeah. you just do that? Yeah, wanna do one? Oh my gosh, look at this pepper. I don't need to get them off there. Look no. at the cabbage. The cabbage is huge. Can you see them? Come here. Oh, I see him. He's just a baby. He's like, I see all kinds of bugs on here. He's probably getting those bugs that eat Ew, the... I hate the feeling of... There's so many. Yeah. Let's see what your mom's reaction is to these. <laughs> Holy shit. <laughs> I forgot to pick them the other day when you told me to. Yeah, I told her to go ahead and pick them because they're starting to go bad. Oh, they're still green and they kind of look like they're going bad. If you guys remember, when I went to the park the other day and I was looking at the rock, there was a dragonfly imprinted onto the rock. I didn't even think about it until we had seen the dragonflies out here. Now Jen has seen real dragonflies. And so I looked up the meaning of what it means to eat dragonflies. It says, a dragonfly symbol represents change and transformation. It is a reminder for you to shed more light and joy in your life. It tells you not to remain in the dark or in the shadows. A dragonfly encourages you to dive into your emotions and ask your spirit to soar with your true colors. Oh, that's cute. And I screenshot it and send it to you on Snapchat too. Oh, yeah, that's cute. I don't know if it's jalapeno or banana. Tell me if it's hot. It's actually really good. It's banana pepper. It's banana? Yeah, okay. It's banana pepper. It's not hot. I just want to make sure I don't remember if it was or not. Don't mind our cardboard mess over there. <laughs> That my pepper? Be better once it's in there. Yeah, pickled? Yeah, I figured. Look, this you is what it looks like inside. Switching over to my iPhone right now, and I'm transferring files from my camera over to the flash drive right now. So, so far, it is working of transferring over. I'll just hopefully, it'll actually let me transfer to my phone. I tried it yesterday. It seemed to work, but that was like my intro. So... These are like longer files, five to six minute videos. So it sucks because I have to go one by one because for some reason it does this extra file, THM. It won't let me transfer any of this. So if I do it all at once, all of these will not transfer. Like say for example, it'll transfer 89, 90, 91, 92, 
and if I did it all at once, it'll end up skipping 94, 95, 96, and I would not know that it's missing. And that's how I get some clips missing out of my vlog, because when I transfer over this, I end up deleting and clearing my S memory card, so that way it's no longer there. I have to do it one by one, just to make sure that actually transfers over. When he's caught playing with the baby kittens. Yeah, I caught you. Leo yeah, wants to be cool. <laughs> Look at this. She's with the sunglasses. Are you want to be a cool kitty? Oh, you want to be cool kitty, Cleo?